Why we don't have a place like this in Thailand? Hey guys, hope you have an amazing and beautiful day. As you guys know that we are still in the pandemic time and in this video I'm going to show you some things really cool that you can't see it in Thailand and I hope it happens in Thailand too. Long time ago I had a video about the canals in Bangkok which I compared it to the Venice. Uh, if you want to see that video you can check the link in the description. And also, uh, when you live in Vienna, you can see lots of parks like this, lots of green area everywhere, which is very, very similar to Bangkok. As you guys know that in Bangkok, we have lots of parks. Anyway, let's back to the topic. The area behind me, it's called uh, Stutt Halle, uh, which is a really famous and known stadium and a big area for um, lots of concerts and lots of events. But the place that I'm going to show you is this place. As you guys know that at this moment, like lots of places, uh, when you want to go, when you want to enter, when you want to join to the party, you want to go for a concert, club, music, anything, they're asking for a vaccine. And actually at this moment, uh, most of the places only accepted vaccinated people. But anyway, some places still accept the PCR test. And here they have a free PCR test. Yeah, it's interesting, right? So in Vienna, the government they opened a place like this, which you can find it everywhere in Vienna, in Austria, that for the people that they can take a free PCR test. The good thing is that this PCR test is different as you see in Thailand, that they put something in your nose and it's so painful or something in the mouth. In fact, they give you this liquid, which is the salty water. And you just need to giggle it here and then spit it in the small bottle of the water and they're gonna give you a result by 24 hours. Is this cool, right? In the past, this place also, they have an antigen as well, but now they have only PCR. For an antigen also, there is a place that you can go for free, which I will show you in this video. As you guys know that in this month, Thailand already opened the country for the tourists without quarantine and also uh, they opened the bars as well, but they still not opened the clubs yet that I heard they're gonna do it at the 1st of December. Anyway, if I think they have some places like this for the free PCR test or even antigen, which can get the results uh, by the 20 minutes or 15 minutes, it's gonna be awesome. Otherwise, just imagine, the same thing is going to happen same as last year, which lots of people go to the clubs and bar and the virus is going to spread easily and the case is going to increase a lot and lockdown happens again. I don't think that uh, these free PCR places is going to be last long because uh, they try and they want that the people get the vaccine. But anyway, they still have it and uh, it's a really good idea. I remember in Thailand, I pay uh, in Bambrung Royal Hospital, I paid 4,000 baht for the PCR test, which it was too much. And I think lots of people, they want to check themselves, but uh, they can't take a PCR because it's expensive, you know. However, I think, uh, I hope they find this good solution very soon. And lockdown never happen again. Behind me, it's a pharmacy. Pharmacy in German language called Apotheke. It's a funny name. Anyway, this is also one of the places that the people can take a PCR test and antigen. They have some separate place, which uh, is over there, but I don't want to get close to that area. And uh, mostly they work every day. And the point is that for these are places like the apotheke or pharmacy, you should have a insurance in Austria that you can go and use it for free just have to bring your uh, insurance card which is called e-cards here it's some green card and then uh, register in there very easy just take maybe one or two minutes and then you can take a test in there they have antigen and they have a pcr and uh, in this place in this apotheke or all these pharmacies they use the gold stick inside your throat or they take it through the nose but the place which I show you before, they just use the liquid, which is much easier. So it depends on you which one you pick. 
I don't know why they don't have a, such a place like this or the other one which I show you in the video in Thailand. I hope they make it one day. At least they can make such a things like this for a people who has insurance in Thailand. As far as I know, the insurance in Thailand, I don't think cover the PCR or antigen test. Anyway, if you guys know it's covered, just let me in the comment section below. Um, I think if they open some place like this, it's gonna be amazing. If they don't wanna be for free, then they can make it, which is connect directly to your insurance, okay? Or if they open it for free, such a place as I show you earlier in the video, it's gonna be awesome, right? Yeah. Another good thing about the places like this is when you register once, they have it in your system, they have your name and information in the system. So when you go again there, you just have to show uh, the QR code that you have or just show your ID and they're gonna make it fast, like really fast. Just take maybe, I told you, maximum of the five minutes to finish this process. Anyway, uh, I have to say also sorry if I walk like this because uh, I had a small injury actually. Something's happened to me a few days ago. I broke my toes uh, and I can't exactly walk. However, I will get well soon and wait for a most interesting video also, which will be coming up on the next week. Um, I think now is the time to say bye. I have to go before it's too late. I have to go inside the supermarket, which is over there and uh, get some groceries because uh, in Austria and I think in most of European country, Sunday is totally closed. It means that there isn't any supermarket open except some uh, local supermarkets or in the train station. But a big supermarket like this and other one is already closed. So once again, thanks for watching. If you have any question or if you want to add something to this video, I'll be appreciate you guys leave the comments down below. Thanks for watching, stay safe, and I will see you on the next video. By the way, before I finish the video, did you realize that people didn't wear the mask at all? Yeah, that's actually quite cool because when you're outside, the government uh, in here, they let the people to not wear the mask, except you go inside the supermarket, you go inside the train, bus station, or some indoor area. Anyway, again, bye, and I see you on the next video.